Solve the matrix equation AX equals the vector 5, 2, where A is the 2 by 2 matrix, 1, 3, minus 1, 4. So we're being asked to solve the matrix equation 1, 3, minus 1, 4, times the vector X, and have the output be the vector 5, 2. If we stare at this, here we have a 2 by 2 matrix times something, and the outcome is supposed to be a 2 by 1 matrix. That means that x had better be a 2 by 1 matrix as well. So let's replace it with a vector in R2. Say the vector x, y. Now, if we were to multiply this matrix product out, taking our rows dotted with our columns, we would end up with the first row times the first column of a 1x plus 3y, and the second row times the first column of a negative 1x plus 4y, and have that being the same thing as the vector 5, 2. Now imagine we were to erase these two, or these four sets of brackets, and look at the two equations separately. And we would find two equations and two unknowns. 1x plus 3y equals 5, and minus 1x plus 4y equals 2. This is something that can be solved using our elimination techniques. We'll make the augmented matrix 1, 3, 5, minus 1, 4, 2, and row reduce this. Notice that if we add the top row to the bottom row, the bottom row could be replaced with 1 plus 1, 3 plus 4, and 5 plus 7, whereas the top row remains unchanged. That bottom row could be scaled by 1 7th to become 0, 1, 1, while the top oops, remains unchanged. Let me fix that. Sorry, that should have been 1, 3, 5. Now we could scale the bottom row through by a negative 3 and add it to the top. Scaling by negative 3, we would have a 0, minus 3, minus 3. And if we add these together, we have a new top row of 1 plus 0, 3 minus 3, 5 minus 3. And so now our augmented matrix has been put into reduced row echelon form. The top line reads x equals 2, and the bottom line reads y equals 1. And so that tells us that our vector x should be the vector 2, 1. Now it's worth pointing out that it's easy to check that this answer works in the original matrix multiplication by plugging it in and simply matrix multiplying. Let's do that right now. We'll replace x, y by 2, 1 and matrix multiply. We're going to find, uh, when we do the first row times the first column, 2 plus 3. When we do the second row times the first column, we're going to have minus 2 plus 4. And that is indeed the vector 5, 2. So the answer checks.